Hey guys, welcome back. This is Rashad Beast from RashadBeast.com. Uh, just want to welcome you guys back to the vlogs. Um, I apologize. I was supposed to upload this two days ago, but I never got a chance to. Uh, I've been working with engineers and a couple of artists, and I've been working, I've been doing a lot of engineering stuff, so um, I apologize for that because it kind of, engineering is very time consuming, so I never really got a chance to upload this. Um, but yeah, um, welcome back. I'm, I'm glad you guys are still with me, and I'm glad you guys are still watching the vlogs. Um, we got a lot more of these coming up soon, so I appreciate everything, all the likes, all the subscribers. Oh, and shout out to my subscribers, everybody. I love you. I have 200, I'm sorry, 239 subscribers. Yeah, 239 subscribers. I have over 239 subscribers. That's a, it's a big, it's a, it's a big number because I remember I couldn't even, I remember back when I couldn't even get one subscriber because I didn't know what to do. But, you know what I'm saying, it's, it's, it's awesome now seeing everything grow, you know, your Twitter, Facebook, all that. It's great seeing everything grow and, you know, it's great because it just shows you that you're progressing throughout the years and, you know, you're getting better, you know, musically, network, network wise and marketing wise, all that. So, um, excuse me, but, um, yeah, so I just want to, um, uh, welcome you guys back. Um, got a lot of more of these coming up, as I said before. Um, I'm actually, I actually want to shout out my man, Nate Perry. Shout out to my man, Nate Perry Beats, man. Um, we have, uh, we have a, I would say, we have a EP coming out. I'm all produced by myself, four tracks. It's going to be a great joint, man. Um, great music. It's going to be really good. Um, right now, I already finished up two. I have to finish up two more. So I'll probably uh, finish those two up this week and, you know, send them off to him so he can work and get into the studio and engineer that. Um, you know what I'm saying? We're working, man. We're working all the way from Colorado to Maryland. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm just, I'm working everywhere, you know what I'm saying? It's just great working everywhere. Just, and in the comfort of your own home, too, you know what I'm saying? So, networking is a really big part. Um, but yeah, man, shout out to Nate, man, because we got some good stuff coming on, and he's, I've been communicating with this guy for about a year now, I would say, uh, great dude, man, I'm glad I met him, you know what I'm saying? We've been talking, we've been talking on and off, you know what I'm saying? We've just been talking and, you know, supporting each other in our music and supporting what we do. And he he was actually the first one of the first the first person to ever grab one of my beats and turn it into a single. You know what I'm saying? So I was just like, wow, that's crazy. And I wasn't even expecting that. Like it's a lot of stuff that I had that that's happened. I didn't really expect. And I was like, whoa, that's you know, that's cool. You know what I'm saying? So it's great. Um yeah, so shout out to Nate, man. Um but on that same platform of networking, I would like to talk about that. Um um there's actually this great website that I just found a couple of days ago, or I would say a week ago, um, uh, shout out to my man, Aaron Stiley, he, he was the one who, who, he's, he's the owner of the website, actually, you know what I'm saying, um, it's a great website, it's called Music Online Network, and on that website, you can actually, you can actually sign up using your Facebook, your Twitter, you can, um, you can, you can network with other folks, and, you can actually like you know you can promote your stuff there. You can you can sign up you can sign up to get interviewed on there. You know what I'm saying? You can do a lot of stuff with that website, man. It's a great website, and a lot of people don't know about it. It's one of those websites that's like I would say undergroundish because it's like it's at a level where it still gets a lot of it's it still gets like you know a lot of people's attention, but it's still you know not a mainstream website like hot new hip hop or you know other stuff like that so you know please please check that out it's a great website sign up you do sign up do whatever do, do whatever you can on there it's a great website and it, it will actually help you market better and network better because you'll be communicating with a lot of people who's on there you know what i'm saying and therefore you can do interviews you can you can you can do a lot of stuff easier you know what i'm saying you can do you can you can actually set up an advertisement for whatever you're selling and you can have that running on your website, I mean, you can, have, I'm sorry, you can have that running on their website, and therefore, you can just have traffic come in there, and, you know, whatever, you, it's just a good, it's another way to use to, uh, it's another great outlet for networking, so, you know, just whatever you do, man, check it out, check out the videos, and the, the feature stuff, you can check out all the ads, on the ad, on the website, it's like an ads, an ads board, where they shift through all the ads that, that are put out by people on that website, 
And you can see your advertisement on there if you sign up and put it on there. So, you know, man, uh, shout out to Aunt Sally, man. He owns the website, so if you want to talk to him, um, I, I make sure all the people who are watching this video right now are linked on my Facebook. Everybody in here is watching this tag. Um, but, you know what I'm saying, you guys can also connect to my, my YouTube comments, you know, be sure to comment, etc. But I'll get into all that later. But um, shout out to Aaron, man. I appreciate it. I appreciate all the, the free services he offered me. You know, but um, actually, so I, excuse me. But yeah, so I want to talk about, um, I also want to talk about uh, uh, an issue that I had ran into a couple of weeks ago. Um, it was a, it was a customer. Um, I had a client who wanted me to make a beat for him. You know what I'm saying? And, and the problem was, well, it really wasn't a problem, but I was like, okay, cool. You know what I'm saying? I, I'm, I'm, I'm always open to do customs. You know what I'm saying? You can always contact me and, you know, I'll be like, okay, cool. You know what I'm saying? So, um, the customer wanted me to make a beat for him and I was like, yeah, that's awesome. I'll do that for you. What would you like? You know what I'm saying? So he told me what he wanted and, you know, et cetera. We got that, got that scored away. Make sure I wrote it down so I know exactly what you want. You know, so I'm taking the orders pretty much. You know what I'm saying? Um, so, you know, a couple of weeks passed and whatever. I told him I'll get started on it. And, you know, a couple of weeks passed. I finish it up. You know, I holler, I holler at him. So I'm like, uh, bro, I finished your beat. Would you like to hear a snippet? He's like, sure, bro, send me it. And he sent me his email. So when he sent me his email, I was able to, you know, send a snippet. He listened to it. He loved it. You know what I'm saying? I was like, I'm glad he likes it. He was like, he's like, man, this is a great beat, man. I'm going to definitely have your money. I get paid this week, you know, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. I want to kind of breeze through this. Um, I'm trying to, I want to, I want to breeze through this because I want to focus on, you know, actual stuff. I just want to talk about an uh, incident because I, I feel like it should be talked about. Um... It, it should it should have some light shed on it but um so you know another couple of weeks pass you know i hit him up i'm constantly hitting dude up to you know pay for the beat you know what i'm saying but i'm sorry i'm going ahead of myself so i hit him up next week like hey bro and i didn't get he i, I didn't get a reply i just see a read you know what i'm saying so i see the read and i'm like he reads it but he's not replying maybe he's busy you know what I'm saying? Maybe he's busy. Maybe he'll hook me up whenever he's free. So, you know, I didn't I didn't really think nothing of it. So after that, man, um, I give him more leeway. So I give him another week. So I hit him up another week and I was like I was like, hey bro, uh, I was like, hey bro, I added you I shouted you out on my vlog and he's one of the per people that I, I shouted out on my on my last vlog. I won't say no names, but he was one of the people that I shouted out on my last vlogs. So on top of that you know, I'm like, okay, he reads it. No, he, he's like, uh, link me. So I sent him the link and whatever you watched it. And he's like, oh, that's cool. Thank you. And I was like, yeah, no problem, bro. You know what I'm saying? Just to kind of start a little conversation with him or whatever. So, you know, we talking there for and there and whatever. And I was like, all right. So another week goes by and he's like, um, no, I hit him up. I was like, I'm going to hit you up next Thursday or next Friday or whatever. So I hit him up on that the next Friday after that. And I was like, hey, bro, um... Let me scroll up to it because I want to actually see. I want to actually read this. Where is it? I'm sorry. I said, uh, excuse me. Um, dang it. Come on. Come on. I just had it. Uh, I was like, um, you know, I just kept, I just kept, you know, hitting him up constantly costly i really had to hammer down on this dude for payment and um what i said was i was like hey i was like hey you have to let me know when you will purchase this beat i can't hold on it to any more longer and i really couldn't because like i'm just wasting time you know weeks and weeks just went by and you know i wasn't missing out but the thing but the best thing about it was i wasn't missing opportunities i was actually you know just going for further keeping that on the side you know you know what i'm saying so i wasn't stopping in one spot for this person but the fact that, you know, the fact that, you know, I had to hammer down on this dude just to try to get, you know, paid is just ridiculous. But anyway, so I say I can no lo longer hold on to it. He's like, I, I want to lease some, I want to, he said, hey, what do you say? I'm sorry. Uh, he said, I, I don't have the money for, the, it's too high. I don't have the money for it right now, but I will make sure you get paid fair. So I'm like, okay, man, that's no problem. We can always negotiate with something. So. You know, after that, I told him I can't hold on to the any longer, and he was like, 
he just made up a pretty much a big excuse. I want to breach right through this. He made up a pretty much a big excuse of why he couldn't buy the beat. Instead of just telling me, bro, I don't have the money. Uh, is there any way we can strike a deal? Or is there any way we can work this out? He didn't say anything about that. You know what I'm saying? So I was like, okay, you know what? No. This is a business. This is not a playground. That's exactly what I told him. Or this is exactly one of the uh, one of my rants. I can't lie. It was a rant on that I did on Facebook about it. And if you want to check out my statuses, my recent status, you can check that out as well. But it was just one of those things where, you know, you had enough. You know what I'm saying? So I was like, okay, you know what? I'm not dealing with this. This beat is now not even yours no more. You can't, you have no access to it. I won't do no more business with you. That's exactly what happened. You know what I'm saying? I made sure I told him that. I made sure I told him, told him that, you know, it's not, it's not, the beat's not yours. Don't even worry about paying it no more. You don't have to worry about, you know. Saving up money for it because it's no longer yours. I can put it on my website whenever I want to, but I just, I just won't. I'll probably just scrap it. I'll probably scrap it, honestly. You know, his, it, it, you know, his loss. But you know what I'm saying? I just want to go over that because I, I wanted, I wanted to talk about that because I felt like I shouldn't have to hammer down on people for payment or I shouldn't. You know what I'm saying? If you really had an issue with the, with the instrumental, you could have told me or. If you didn't have the money, you know what I'm saying? I'm, you know, you could have told me we could have always worked something out. That's no, that's no problem. You know what I mean? So I just felt like, you know, he just kept, he just wasted time. And, you know, I don't even care for the money at this point. I just want my time back. But I'll never get time back. You know what I'm saying? It's time. So I just want to shed that light on, on, onto that certain situation to make sure that, you know, certain people need to understand that this is a business. This is not a playground. We keep... We keep everything, you know, or certain, you know, we keep everything at a professional level when it comes to stuff like this, because you know it's a transaction, you know. You know what I'm saying? I do so. I make this for you. You pay me for that, etc. You know what I'm saying? It's a transaction. You gotta, you gotta step to a professional level. You know what I'm saying? I'm not trying to say pay me now, or or you know pay me now. You know what I'm saying? I want my money. You know I'm not like that. You know what I'm saying? I mean that's the mind frame that you have to have though. You know what I'm saying? You have to eat. You know what I'm saying? Period. And you don't, and there's nothing worse than wasted time. You can waste money all the time. You can make it back. But there's nothing worse than wasted time. So I honestly felt like I wasted all my time trying to, you know, make the beat. I made, I made the beat for nothing pretty much. And then I didn't get paid for it. So I was just like, you know what, whatever. <laughs> I'm moving on. You know what I'm saying? You're, you're at the bottom of the food chain pretty much. So, you know, off that though, you know what I'm saying? I wish that person much love is I, I i give that person all, all the love i'll give that person i'm sorry I'm sure. give that person all the love and much success to him for for in a career you know what i'm saying i, I you know what I'm saying i give credit where credit is due and you know i just make sure people you know there's nothing there's no malice between anybody it's just you know certain thing that i just wanted to get off my chest i felt like it was just one disrespectful two i just felt like <laughs> You wasted my time. You could have just told me, bro, I can't afford this beat. Uh, I'll probably sleep some of your stuff for. We could do something, you know. You know, whatever. You could just say something, you know what I'm saying? As long as you say something to me, it, it would have been cool. But, you know, he just kept ducking and he didn't even say nothing to me until the last second. So, can't really help those type of people anyway. So, but, you know, I wish him much love and much, much success to that person regardless. So, anyway, but I want to get off that. Um, I want to talk about, let's see. We already covered the network, so I want to talk about. Uh, I want to talk about the new website. I have a new website layout coming out um, for my website. I'm going to change the whole thing. You know, the, the I like my old one, but I want to make it new because I don't like it no more. <laughs> so, but I have another. I have a new website layout coming out soon, and I'll make sure um, I have that coming with. Uh, you know, with a great grand release, I'll probably drop a vlog that same day and like, yeah, guys, you guys should check it out. Look at, look at the new things and, you know, just, you know, just be sure to check it out. And, you know, you know, look at the new stuff that was uploaded to it. And by then I'll probably have like a couple of new beats uploaded for that, just for that specific moment. But, um, you know, um, yeah, that's another thing. What else there to talk about? I'm sorry, I'm just I'm I'm doing this all off the top of my head, so I'm trying to think of what else we can talk about. Um, let's talk about investments. That's what I would like to talk about right now. I would like to talk about investments, and you know, just and this is based off of uh, what I said with my with one of my my 
clients um, about investing. You know what I'm saying? It's always important to invest into your business, especially music. You can't make music without money. You need money to make more music. You know what I'm saying? You have to get the money so you can make, so you can upgrade your stuff. Everything in this room, this piano, you know what I'm saying, the sofa, there's a mic right there. You can't see a mic right there. I have a machine on here. You know what I'm saying? I got a lot of equipment. And these these dope speakers right here. Those are a lot of money. Worth like thousands of dollars worth of this stuff in here. You know what I'm saying? And that's just all from, you know, investing. You know what I'm saying? It's always good to invest. Um, it's never I mean, you can you don't always have to invest in your money. You can you don't always have to invest, but it's good that you do some type of investments because that's the only way you can really move forward in, in your in your business is you can't you can't put no money in and expect um you can't put money in and like i would say i would say you can't put you can't not you cannot put money in i'm sorry you cannot put money in and expect to get money from that of course that's not gonna work you have to put money in you know what i'm saying only way to make money is to spend money you know what i'm saying so uh, i would just like want to you know shed light on that but um on top of that, we'll say, like, artists getting free beats, um, you know what I'm saying? Artists and free beats, it's, it goes hand-in-hand hand with the with, with that, you know what I'm saying? Certain producers do it, like, you know, like, oh, yeah, if I get 100 subscribers, I'm dropping, I'm dropping new beats, and uh, new, I'm dropping one free beat for, for download. I, you know, that's cool. That's cool, because, you know, you're giving out a gift to the uh, customer or whatever, you know, or to, to your, your, your fan base, I would say. You know that's that's great that's really good that's a great way to do it and then we got a couple of other producers just to give out free beats like it's nothing you know what i'm saying um it's nothing wrong with that but it just it can it can backfire you know what i'm saying just know that it can backfire like for me i make sure the people all the new people all the people who have signed up to my newsletter they get two free beats period off top you know just to start you off that's all you're gonna get from me though and to, like that's all that's all you're gonna get first time meeting you know what i'm saying um, cause I have to, like, I can't, I can't like have a whole bunch of freebies cause then people will take advantage of it. You know what I'm saying? If I, if I had people taking advantage of it, I won't make no money. Therefore I wouldn't be running the business. I'd just be giving out free stuff. You know, I can't do that. You know what I'm saying? That's not how I'm supposed to do that. You know, can't make money that way. So, you know what I'm saying? Free beats. I have no problem with free beats. Uh, I just want to say that I, I like giving out free beats. And I like when people sign up because they get the free beats ASAP. As soon as they sign up, they get a beat, the two free beats in like one hour. You know what I'm saying? They just got to check their mail. But for artists that's just forever looking for free beats, you're not going to find free beats like that. I'm telling you right now. You're going to be wasting your time and you're going to just be wasting opportunities you could have taken looking for free beats. You know what I'm saying? There are plenty of dope producers out here who put their heart and their soul into this music shit, man. Cause there's a lot of there's a lot of there's a lot of people who just put their heart and souls in this music, you know what I'm saying, to sell. They they nobody wants to give their art away. Nobody should should be obliged to give their art for, give their art away for free. You know what I'm saying? Like no no man, that's not how it works. You know what I'm saying? So artists just feel free to feel free to like take advantage, but don't take too much of an advantage of it. See what I'm saying? Like I would like to say for like artists, man, like I had a actually had a conversation with one of my clients. Um, one of my clients, man, my man Carlos, man, shout out to Celos, the Golden Child, Southside Entertainment, Southside the Movement, shout out Southside, the whole Southside family, shout out to them. I had a, I had a, you know, I had a talk with him like uh, I'll say a couple of weeks ago, damn near, damn near like uh, the ending of of July, the ending of July. Last time I talked to him, really. Um, and we was just talking about, you know, you know, he was just talking about like investments and, you know, beats and et cetera. We was just talking about a whole bunch of music stuff. And what he, you know, what he told me is, man, he's like, man, we have a lot. Of, he, he, what he told me was that he purchased beats because he, no, he likes purchase, purchasing beats. I'm sorry. He like, he told me he liked purchasing beats and, um, not because, you know, and it's not even because of support, but he knew that it was the only way he'll be able to turn that into a true song. You know what I'm saying? So he understood that he had to invest in order to be, to be get to, to, I'm sorry, I'm, to begin, like, to begin a better, a better career, to be, I can't talk, to begin a better career plan. So he honestly felt 
Like, you know, in order to really make this thing successful, you got to really invest. And that's honestly the truth, you know what I'm saying? So all the artists who, who feel free, who, who, who like, who, I would say they like to, like, take beats or get beats that are tagged, but you have to buy them, they would still rip them off YouTube or whatever, you know, and, like, um, I, I wouldn't recommend doing that, honestly, but, you know what I'm saying, I'm just, it's just, just, just advice, you know what I'm saying, make sure you have permission and also just make sure you're, you're, um, that producer is like willing to work out something with you, you know what I'm saying, because we are willing to work with you as long as you work with us, you know what I'm saying, as long as you talk to us and show us that you are looking, that you are looking for certain things, we will, we will go out of our ways to contact you, no matter where we at, we, we could be at work doing something, and we'll stop, stop doing what we're doing, care less, and, and hit you up, you know what I'm saying, you know what I'm saying, so shout out to all my producers, shout out to all my artists, all the artists that are getting this, that are watching this video right now, shout out to you, um, everybody that I tagged, shout out to y'all, um, shout out to my subscribers once again, I love you guys, appreciate it, 238 followers, or subscribers, I'm sorry, and, you know what I'm saying, and it's, and rising, you know what I'm saying, it just, it just gets better, it gets better every day, so, just wanna thank you guys for everything, thank you for watching this new vlog, um, I wish, um, next vlog, I'll be explaining a lot more, or not a lot more, but some new, some newer things, and this time I probably, I won't do it off the top no more. I'll probably write it down, but I feel like if I get better with it all off top, I'll get better with it, you know, writing it down. So I want to take it a step by step, you know, process after process, you know, I just want to get better with this and, um, you know, make sure you guys hear me, make sure you guys know that I'm real, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I'm not a fake person. I'll make sure that you guys are taken care of no matter what. But if you have any questions about beats submissions uh anything advertisements and networking and if you need advice please contact me you can contact me via facebook i'll give you my number um you can email me you can twitter you can go on twitter dm me whatever whatever you feel you need to contact me on do it man i'll leave all my information below just for you um please leave a comment and a like i appreciate that and if you can share this video you can do that as well i don't really i'm not too big on sharing vlogs because it's just a vlog um and and it's funny, I just got a contact right now. Somebody just contacted me just, just now. Not even not even playing, you know what I'm saying? So, you know what I'm saying? If you have anything, if you need anything, please contact me. I will I will work with you and we will talk. You know what I'm saying? But um, on top of that, just want to thank you guys for watching again. Uh, more vlogs coming soon. New beats are coming soon as well. So be on the lookout for uh, the new website lo the new website layout, uh, new beats, all that. You know what I'm saying? Just want to thank you guys for watching. And God bless. Stay up and keep on, keep on making music. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? So uh, I'm, I'm gonna stop doing this off topic. But uh, you guys take care, man. See you later. Rashad beats out. Shit.